Hello. So I, I'm not going to be able to get a video out for tomorrow's Summer Heroes update again. So I decided to make another... I just decided to make another Helmet Heroes video, but on a different topic. And it's going to be about the Botter Invasion. Yes. Oh my god, what's happening here? Free XP? Question mark. Yes, please. Oh my god. Ooh, Ski Mask. Nice. Anyways, I'm making this video because lately for like, I don't know for how much long, but this game's been having so much botters and like, they're not getting banned in like a good amount of time so like in the discord server you can you can report players for botting it seems seems good right but it takes like a while for the botters to actually get banned so you have to so even though if you reported them like a couple days prior before them getting banned they probably transferred all their money to like a different account already so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into Bouncer Cave because that's where botting is most common. Bro, botting is getting a lot more advanced now instead of just like standing in a single place and like attacking. Now there's like, there's like key movements and stuff. For the first time in a while I'm not seeing any botters at the moment which is pretty impressive. Probably because the server got shut down like six times already today and people lost so much progress. You botting man. Um, <laughs> all right, buddy. Nice voting, bro. <laughs> EPLZ. Yep, nice voting, man. I can stand here for like 60 minutes and he'll still be in the same spot shooting there and then going back there so he can collect the money. Thing is, they make themselves so blatant and. When you report them in the server, sometimes they get worried and they try to defend themselves, but you're this blatant and you're like standing here for eight hours just botting and you're saying that, mm -mm, I'm not botting. Yo, should I get cowboy set first or better gun? Are you talking about this guy? Because he's literally AFK. Alright, cool. See ya. Always. Anyways, I only found one botter here. Never mind, I found another one. <laughs> I didn't think this guy was botting before, but he's purely naked. This armor, mine. Anyways, this guy's. Yeah, he didn't pick up the armor, so obviously botting. I also can't seem to even get up. I'm gonna go to the next area where I usually see a lot of botters, and that is. Uh... Probably Mushroom Village or Crabs. I'll be there in a bit. Oh my god. Drop. I drop an item. Nice item game. I think I got shades. I did. I've been noticing recently in the Discord server that people are selling botted accounts to like for real money. And basically what that means is that they're they're selling the accounts that they've bought it on and if that's been reported for like IRL money, so like the person that's buying the account is technically getting scammed because their, their account is going to get deleted and they just paid money for it without like they don't do any background research or anything so their account just gets deleted without them knowing and basically that makes it so that botting in this game is profitable and that's kind of dumb to be honest come on i'm just I'm pretty sure it's not that hard to get a job even, even if your grades are like not that good i'm pretty sure you can still get a job somewhere and the other issue is that most of the botters that are being reported they don't get banned. It takes them like a month or a couple of weeks to get banned, and it probably um, how can I say this? It mo it makes people, it makes other people f like want to bot too, cause like they're not getting banned, so there's a high chance that they won't be getting banned too if they start botting. Like I said, it takes like a couple of weeks or like a month for Robbie to actually see it and ban them, but they'll transfer the money to one of their main accounts by the time they're banned so there isn't really a point in reporting that's probably why I'm not reporting players cause there's no point if like uh if it takes like a month or or weeks for them to even get banned in the first place cause they already transfer all the money that they've gone off their account to like their main okay <laughs> there's no way you guys are botting right
Yeah, good luck trying to convince me you're not vying, bro. What are these movements? Are these like the exact same accounts? They have like perfect... <laughs> they have like symmetrical movements, but just like on opposite ends. I can just sit here for at least another two hours and they'll still be in the same spot. I don't know why they should just not receive like an IP ban or something. Uh, I, I don't see what's the point of doing IP bans anyways, because they'll just change their IPs and they'll be right back to square one. These people are like level 60 plus. Hot damn. Usernames, Itum that drew, and the other guy is uh, Sane Fei. Anyway, so basically what I'm trying to say is that there needs to be like probably an in-game mod or something that can actually be trusted and not abuse the powers that they're given. And they should go around giving temporary bans or like just bans for like a couple days or something. I guess that's a temporary ban, but there should be a mod in-game that wanders around and check people to see if they're botting or not. Anyways, that's probably all I have to say for this video. Um, like and subscribe, all that jazz. I'll upload this video next Friday. It won't... No, no, I'll upload this video this following Friday, which is the 30th. Yep, okay. Uh... Yep, see you on the next one. Bye.